I haven't counted them all. Over 30,000 components, you know. That many! The most common materials for the components are steel, aluminium, and plastic. Wow. Uh-huh. So, you don't know that much about cars. But I thought you were the expert. <laughs> hmm. So, let's take a look at how the components are made. First of all, there's casting. This method of melting metal and pouring it into a mold to harden is called casting. Another method of making metal components is forging. With forging, the metal is hit with huge forces to shape it. Here come the forged parts now. Where are they? The newly forged components are then machined to an accuracy of hundreds of parts per millimeter. There, finished. They're gear wheels. Bumpers and other plastic components are made from plastic pellets, which are melted and poured into mold to harden. Components are made by all sorts of methods, aren't they? Now here's question two. Do you know what this is? What's that? This is what will become vehicle bodies. No way. It's true, kid. So, would you like to come with us to visit the factory where car bodies are made? Factory? I want to go. You all want to come too, don't you? But... How do we get to the factory? I have to ask. Now, everyone, this is the press shop. This sheet steel is the material for the car. Ooh, they look heavy, don't they? One roll weighs about 10 tons. Once this sheet steel has been unrolled and cut to the necessary size, it's ready for use. The sheet steel goes on to be processed into various different shapes. Like this press? This press takes a flat steel sheet, forces it into a metal mold called a die, and creates a three-dimensional component like this. This is a die assembly. The pressing is about to start. I must get closer to see this better. Up oh, there, kid. Oh, look at those amazing machines all lined up. Hey, everyone, they're starting. The components are made in the press in a continuous flow. Machines do all of this automatically, you know. Here they are. A single press can make various different components. All of the components are gathered together and move on to the next stage. Ah, I've become a door! Where am I going? My, oh my, you're looking good, aren't you? This is the welding shop. Welding? The stars in here are robots. Using heat generated by electricity to stick components together is called welding. Wow, maybe I should get closer for a better view. Haven't you learned? We're usually forbidden to come here, but today is special. Can, can I wait on this? Okay, 
But be careful where you go. Ah, uh, yeah. There are robots everywhere. This is where bodies are assembled, you know. On this line, the components are put together to create the body of the car. types of vehicles are assembled on the one line here. It's amazing they don't get them mixed up. This is beginning to look like a car, isn't it? Yes, it is. Next is the paint shop. Would you like to come with me? The body is cleaned with water and chemicals, you see. This water is used repeatedly to avoid waste. We're going over there next. The rust-proofing coating is stuck to the body by a voltage of over 300 volts. That's much higher than the mains voltage in your home. After a thorough drying in the drying room, it's on to the next stage. What's happening now? Ah! It's time to apply the paint. To end up with a beautiful color, first a color is chosen for the undercoat. Then the undercoat is painted carefully over the entire body. Robots here too. This time I'm safe, aren't I? Yes. Yeah. Hey. Oh. Right on to the next stage. Yes. Yeah. Look at that. It's nearly finished. It's become all nice and shiny, hasn't it? Ooh, look. I'm all nice and shiny too. Are we done now? There's still something important to do, you know. After the painting is finished and the paint is dry, the vehicle goes through strict inspections. A painstaking visual inspection to check that there are no paint smudges or scratches is extremely important. After all my hard work, they have to check carefully, don't they? Right. It's okay. At this point, the car's body is complete. Making a car is really a lot of work, isn't it? But it was fun, wasn't it? Absolutely! Well then, I'm going on to the assembly shop. Bye, everyone! Eh? What? You mean you all want to see the assembly shop too? Actually, the assembly stages are introduced outside this theater. There are robots there too. Well, see you again! Hola, Isaac.